All right, I'm gonna try and do it the way Adam does it. Greatest day ever. Stay tuned to the end and I'll show you why. Okay, so I went to that new shopping area. It's really nice. It's another county. So I wanted to go see if they had chicken. I'll tell you in a minute if they did. This is also where there's, we have the biggest CVS I've ever seen. They have like um everything there, everything there. They have really nice nail polish, a ton of lipstick, really nice jewelry. Oh my God. They had really cute earrings, but they were pink and I wanted red. They were pink hearts, but I wanted red. They had a red necklace but I don't want to take this guy off and I don't like to wear layered necklaces because it gets the chains all tangled. And then I'm like, you like it because the earrings and the necklace because the earrings were red. I said, yeah, you're right. So I didn't buy them, but oh my God. I went to all those stores in the malls to get this. I don't, for the love of God, don't ask me if there are any scissors are. I do not know. These were not cheap. These were expensive. These were $15, but Oh my God, you know, my outfit, my coat's red, my coat's white, my what coat is red and goes right with white. So they got hearts on them. Oh, by the way, it's freezing out. It's freezing. Tomorrow we'll be above 40. So it, and it's on white on the inside. So tomorrow is the day to go out. And tomorrow we are going to the city because I got my, oh, these are nice and warm too. I love, this is a perfect, I need my fingers out so I can touch the camera. I can get my bus pass and all that stuff. Um, I got my new Metro card and they have, it's no, there's no money on it. So to get money on my Metro card, I have to go to the subway station. I don't like going to the subway station. It's a pain in the butt. So I have to go before the new, my old card expires because the old card has about $40 on it and I need to take the money from my old card put it on the new card and if I don't do it before my old card expires I will have no money on my bus pass and I will not be able to travel in New York I would have to go to the Port Authority subway station and I don't want to go down there it's a bit of a walk and there's no reason for me to go there I don't like it down there so I'm going to go to um take the 104 go to Columbus Circle and I'll go downstairs to Turnstile. And it's funny, it's going to Turnstile because when I was talking to the woman, the producer, what was her name, Sabrina, for the Wendy Williams show, we were talking about Columbus Circle and the Turnstile downstairs because she lives out in Long Island, but she remembers the Turnstile. So we were talking about that. Matching hat. Oh my God. I totally shouldn't just rip this thing out. Wait. Ah, yeah. Okay. So cute, so soft, red, white hearts. Awesome. I'm all set for Valentine's Day. Although I'll be a week in Florida. <laughs> I can't really wear this guy. How cute. I look so cute. <laughs> so I got that. And then these were really just extras because I tend to lose everything. And these were 11. They're just basic white things. A green, uh blue fingerless ones and they're very very soft they had a matching hat but it didn't have a pom-pom and it was very blase looking i didn't like that oh my god okay i totally love marshmallow chocolates because they're very low in calories this whole thing is only 110 calories it is so good and of course what was their sale buy two get two free i don't know what happened to the fourth I have no idea. So good. Oh my God. They only had one strawberry one. I got the strawberry one, but this was so good. It was really good. So I, I had to get four. I don't know what happened to the fourth one. It got eaten somewhere along the line. So yeah. Isn't this cute? Oh my God, I love it. It's so cute. I can't believe CVS had it. It's perfect. The pot, I love it. I love it. I love it. So we, we, I went to, then from there, it's, it's a cute little mall. It's a cute little mall. They used to have a jewelry store, but it closed down. Um, so right across the, there's, and then there's a, there's a little shop with junky stuff, but I didn't go in there. I went right to the, um, the bazaar. Is that what it's called? I forget what it's called. Some kind of supermarket. I don't know. You know, I've been there a couple of times now. And wait a minute, I'll save that for last. So 
as I figured I'm not gonna be there for a while. Let me get this now. This was eight or, I think it was $9. I spent almost 90-ish dollars at the, um, uh, the supermarket. CVS was about 60 to 70. Uh, I did buy a few other things and they may or may not have been eaten. So they're not here anymore. The evidence is gone, is gone. I like nuts. I really like nuts. I have a thing for nuts. I love my hat. I'm sorry, but it's so freaking cute. So I got this. Oh my God. So I, I'm trying to take it out of the car and I flipped his head off. It literally went flying. I was like, oh God. Yeah, that's me. Always make it a scene. So his head comes off. These are $9. They didn't have the little bags like they had the last time. And these do really good on YouTube and TikTok. So I says, well, let's get it because I don't think I'll be back for a while because I'm going to Florida and stuff. So I figured, let me get it now. So I got that. Surprise, his head lasted. They had the, um, the teddy bear. They had a, that's right. They had a really cute brown teddy bear, but they had a different type of a candy and it wasn't the kind. I don't know what it was, so I didn't buy that. So I got him. Um, eggs are expensive as hell. And they only had brown eggs. These were $2.19 a dozen. I know they were too, supposed to taste the same, but I don't really like brown eggs just because I'm so used to white eggs, but all right, whatever. So I got two dozen eggs. Okay, I feel like it's Friday already. It's not, today's Monday, right? It's just Monday. We're just starting, we're just starting. Uh, I'll show you if I'm, I had gotten picked. They were looking for influencers for cloudy. It's, um, cloud bread, keto diet type thing. I mean, I'm not on a keto diet, but we're not allowed to have bread. So these were perfect for me. So I applied and all I do is post a picture of it. It's very good though. It's really, really good. And I did, I ate them. I was like, damn, these are good. So I got the stuff to make cloudy. So I'll make a video when I do it. The only problem is it said to get light cream cheese. This was all they had. They had whipped cream cheese, but all full fat. We were supposed to get low fat, but this was all they had. And holy crap, shit, it was expensive. I don't, this was the one on sale, probably expiration date. I've noticed this about this store. If it's gonna expire. Oh no, it's good till June. Okay, so this was like $3 or something. They had other ones that were like $9. <sighs> whatever i got this even though it's not exactly what the recipe called for they had the lemon ginger tea so i got that for florida let me throw it there oh good i sure never see that again maybe one of the two boxes will make it i got this for my crunch video because i don't think i did many of the cupcake crunches so i have that wait i'll just throw there oh since adam did that stupid scream thing and he made popcorn i've been craving popcorn so Again, they didn't have much to choose from. And I liked how clearly marked the calories were. There's three packages in there and it says it's 130 calories. So this had the lowest amount of calories. So I got this one and there wasn't any other brand. Did, I don't think they had Order of Merit. They did have the calories are right in the front on Oval Redenbacher. And I was just at a point like, fine, I'll just take this. So I got this. Um, I wanted my mozzarella oh my gosh i got some smoked mozzarella this was like eleven dollars it's louisi's or louisi i don't know some kind of smoked natural mozzarella so because you know i love my mozzarella they had it wasn't too bad but it was very confusing they had two pounds one pound eight ounces and the two pound, of course, was the more economical, but sometimes it goes bad faster because it's natural and they don't have all the preservatives. And that's just, so screw it, just get that one. So I just got that one, but I did get something else. I picked up another one of these. Oh no, this is new. Cinnamon, it's a flavor. It looked good. I never saw it before. And I said, well, we'll come up with something to put that on because it looked really good. So I got it. Um, where are you? Where are you? Uh, here we go. Uh, I wanted something different cheese-wise because 
the cheddar I have doesn't have, it's not that sharp. So I got some Romano, Romano cheese and some Parmesan. I put something different on my meal, put them in there. And I got, oh, this is only 89 cents. So I figured it can't hurt to get that because it's so much cheaper than going to the Instacart. I got food dye just in case any um, snow comes. Uh, I got some gum. I thought for the plane, actually. Let me put you in there. Well, you know, I'm going to lose it. I'll, I'll probably buy more gum by then. I got this because it's really good. The chicken seasoning, this is really good. And it's cheaper if I can pick it up myself. Now, this is for the cloud bread cream of tartar. You have to make, so you have to separate your egg whites from the yellows, the yolks. And... You, the cream of tartar makes the soft peaks and you gotta it's, it's very simple i'll make a video we'll see how that works out i don't like making my own because you don't know exactly calorie wise but let's try it anyway and then i was hoping by crossing county lines going to another county they would have chicken and oh my god we hit the mother load and it was on sale a dollar a pound so that was good they had a ton of it I bought six packages of chicken and actually I, I gotta go break this all up and freeze them. So I'm really glad I got that chicken. I got six chickens. Uh, I did buy a hot chicken and I ate that as soon as I came in and it was good. It was $7. I never had their brand rotisserie chicken because usually I come home and I'll just make my own, but I was tired and I said, let's try. It was very good. It was really good. The breast meat was not overcooked. It was delicious. It was really, really good. So I had that chicken for my, that's what I ate. That's what I've eaten all day. And well, maybe a marshmallow and some peanuts. Well, no, cashews and almonds. I love nuts. All right, so that was, that's all chicken. Chicken, chicken, chicken. So that's what I got. It was it's expensive, you don't buy much. And this is still cheaper than Instacart, so. Uh, they had onions on sale for a dollar, but I still have onions. I still have spinach. So I didn't buy any of that. And then tomorrow I want to go to, um, like I said, the um, Columbus Circle. I'm going to hit downstairs, the turnstile, renew my Metro card. I'm not going to eat anything down there. I didn't like what they had the last time. Just going to go there for the card, take some photos. It's going to be 40 degrees. So tomorrow's going to be a nice day. The rest of the week's supposed to be super cold and very uncomfortable. So it's like, if I don't go tomorrow, the rest of the week can be really cold. I don't know if we're having this. They keep saying every Saturday like we're having a storm, but we'll see what happens, whatever. So that's what I did. Okay, what is in my pouch? What is the greatest thing that came in the mail today? <gasps> I got my passport. Oh my God. I love it. I look like a Russian spy. I'm not going to show you the picture. And I got it with extra pages so I can get it. I have how many pages? Comes with 50 pages for visas. So I can travel to China, India, wherever the hell I want. I'm free to be. <laughs> I am so happy. I got this in less than a month. In less than a month. That's fantastic. I am so happy. I'm blessed. I'm grateful. Now I can go anywhere I want. Oh, China, here I come, Hong Kong, woo. Everybody's in Hong Kong, that's like the place to go. So I'm glad I got this, cause to fly, you're gonna have to get that upgraded thing and oh, that's a hot mess. But now I have this, I'm good for 10 years and it's good till January 32, I believe. All right, let me see. Uh-huh, January 32, 2032, so I'm thrilled. I'm glad. I can't believe how fast it came. Because I remember in the summer, they were like four months backlogged. And that was, it was rough because my passport was expiring. It was still good. I had until June. So that's what made it easy to get um, it filled faster too, because it was still a valid passport. Everything's faster if it's valid. So I haven't gotten my uh, passport card that's always mailed separate, but this is all I need to get the hell out. So I'm free. Here we go. Here we go. World, watch out. She's got her passport. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.